Smack dab in the middle of the first official week of June. June 7th, 2023. Tyler Hayes here. 2050 coming to you from Lady Smith with a video lined up for you. We have the S772 power along with a couple of cars, including an autonomous inspection car on the tail that was brought in on the S772 today which arrived here since 1510 and went westbound a few minutes later. As you can see, ES44AC 2846 actually led on that, while SD75I 5794 is in the middle second, and third was the X-City Rail of the 3932. And 3932 decided to do the honors for the return with those two sand hoppers and that autonomous inspection car. The autonomous inspection car was right behind the 3932 at the time when I saw it go westbound. Still, I gotta say though, it was quite a shock though to see the very familiar 2846 back for more. There's a bit of a horn, odd horn setup on the 3932 there. Look at that there as we roll slowly along. So there's a better look at it. with its traditional Canadian K3L. And I see the crewmen are still on board the 2846, no doubt. The S772. something. Check that out at a better angle. Alright, it is actually the return of CNIS 412060 again. And I see the red laser for checking the main line while rolling for any bad track along the way is still lit, which is a pretty cool sight. How about that? There you go, the return of uh, S772 with this autonomous inspection car of CNIS 412060 as tail with uh, EOT going. Alright, almost near the downtown now. We're having a look at the return of the S772-81. I know I did get some of the inbound sand empties that I think I would have gone to Warehouser or actually they might have went to Poskin more than likely. More than likely to Poskin. Well, the Thomas inspection part of it left in 
classist and must have picked up a couple loads for the return to Lady Smith's yard. Now that I am in downtown Elm, as you can see in front of me, at mile 353.17 at the crossing bungalow light is restored normal since last evening as it was uh, flashing because of lights out for the maintenance away high rail truck shop and lights of their gravel driveway and it's nearby the depot The 529C was needed, so I'm pretty relieved to find out that they must have restored it during the night. And this crossing here at the smile post working normally. Meanwhile, we'll have a southbound on the way on the Superior Sub Main that I have a feeling the S772 is waiting on. A signal indication is set for that at this time. It's currently well north of Lady Smith at the moment. Hang tight for another several minutes and check out what that one is. And then we'll check out the move of the returning S772 head into Lady Smith Yard and complete the assignment for the evening. Area 2114 southbound was uh, spotted just north of Milepost 355 and should be ready to come into Lady Smith here in another few moments here. May have a, a general freighter to be honest for this one that is going to meet the S772, it's a return, but it's still sitting at West Lady Smith, about ready to shove on the North Y, as the 2848, excuse me, 2846 will do that, while the 3932 will lead it, while the conductor leads for the shove on that move. So with that, Let's have a look at our southbound as we will lean back and get them. Here we go. We also have the Halcon shuttle van of 8759 on standby to pick up the S77 crew there at the north end of Lady Smith Yard. That's where they're going to pick them up to end the night. Positioned at the Lady Smith Ace Home Center. Area 2119 southbound has just made it into the northern end of Lady Smith. Check them out on the roll by. Gate drop. Tier four. Thirty-two sixty was back. Thirty-three, three, and twenty-eight, forty-five.
see a, a lightning car in there. Didn't expect that to be a tow, but that is a big surprise. I never saw that before. <laughs> Very unusual. M344! DPU! And another return of the C6M rebuild of the 3302! What is it doing back? Goodness sakes! Expect the return of the 3302 again. Remember back during the winter months in December, it led on the S773. Here's the last of it an ATX 401 283. End of train devices going. And that will do it for the M344 81 of the 7th. And we'll do it for this video. For the 344. Now we're going to have signals set for the returning S772. So that we'll now get signals set to make the move into Lady Smith Yard, and that is coming right up. Stick around. It's 2125. The S772 is coming around on the north Y and ready to go into Lady Smith Yards. Check him out on the shelf as we lean back and get him. Twenty forty six. Once again, doing the honors while the conductor rides on the shelf. So we come with the two sand loads and the autonomous inspection car 412 060 from CNIS. as the last sand load. And once again, CNIS 412060 is the last of the S772. End of train device is going for the S772's return. And that will do it for today and this evening here at Lady Smith. Thank you guys for watching. See you next time. I'll see you down the main line. Tyler Hayes out.